we're now looking at um, seven or well six, seven, nearly eight weeks of non-stop fire for across from Western to Eastern Canada. So it's covering a huge area at a, at a scale that we haven't seen, at least in, in the data set that we have that covers the last 20 years and, um, and still no end in sight. In terms of the climate implications, you also have the, the soot and the black carbon, which under the right atmospheric uh, flow can end up in, in the Arctic and be deposited on sea ice or deposited on the, the Greenland ice sheet, which would then potentially accelerate the melting um, and, and contribute to climate in, in that way. Talk about like the air quality of I mean, I think this is the, sort of the, the generally the direct um, implications. I mean, I mean, but carbon emissions are tied to this as well. I think the only thing is we don't know how much of it stays in the atmosphere right now. We need that. That's a longer term process. Yeah.